For every Shantae in the room, please back pass. Oh, only one Shantae. Oh well. Hey, Ray Cross here. Welcome back for more Shantae Risky's Revenge. Last time, we went over the Emerald Baron, gave him the uh, passport. I gave him the deed to Skull Down, excuse me. Which he wanted to name uh, Emerald Town. We got our previous citizenship. Alright, this, uh, this time, well, we're gonna be going in the opposite direction from the. Uh, Emma Baron and yes, the um, Orb Spray Pistol. And be on our way to the Emma Baron's Bell Tower, the rear. Ow. Over here, ow. Yeah. Got slapped by a mummy. That hurts. Yeah, these guys can take, uh, take away an entire heart with damage. Yeah, These guys are really strong. Thanks for interrupting my intro, douche nozzle. Jeez. Oh, whatever. Anyway, going up, going forward, this is what I have. I have the um, Storm Puff Pike Pole and the Super Pike Pole. The Super Pike Pole, I'm going to show quick. It has two Pike Poles instead of just one. Whereas in Parts Curse, the Super Pike Pole is straight. Well, yeah, that would be the Mega Pike Pole in this game, which I couldn't get the same round. I'm really, I'm playing it. Really risky game here. Ha ah, ah, ha ah, risky game. <laughs> I can't have that. You might have noticed I also have nine health potions as well as get magic bells. Not exactly the most useful thing in the world, but if you tend to be um, careless in the magic per se, you would be it would be beneficial to have at least a few magic bells, especially for it's coming up ahead. There's a uh, disabled man here. Just in case, you know, I'm gonna go ahead and use him because I do not trust myself to do a very good job, despite how much I prepared for this area. Great. Kind of odd how there's like a flower here in the desert. But let's go in. It's the battle tower. Names better could main names better could have killed. This here is the bell tower. You got a passport? No! Sorry kid, citizens only. We'll see the ammo around. Enlist, and you'll give you and you'll get you straightened out. That or do a saucy dance. That's how far could have jumped. So you got in by doing a saucy dance, what? Okay, that's pretty funny. Can you imagine Derek and Joe doing a saucy dance to get into the army? Oh, <laughs> uh, that'd be funny. Battle Tower, Battle Tower, ba Battle Tower rules are simple. Enter these 20 gems. Clock starts once you pass through that door. The clock and you win. A lot of folks die trying, so I hope you save first. Ah, Derek and Joe has dumped on the, um... Fourth wall break bandwagon I see. Also I love how there's um cardboard box in front of them as a reception test. It's like the Emma Baron um, budget ran low due to having so many men in his army that he couldn't afford a proper desk. <laughs> Alright, we're in. Alright, you're ready to go. Knock him there. Yes, you actually need twenty gems in an incendiary, which isn't too bad. Anyway, battle tower here. It's basically just a gauntlet of enemies. Also, I... Yeah. It may be also good to have some, uh, silky, cre silky cream coming into this. Because you have roughly 10 floors to go through. So each time you clear a floor, you do have some additional clocks, so that is kind of nice. But, don't confuse that with state generosity. The time limit is still fairly strict. Okay, that is why I run in with all the items that I have. That I have. So going here, taking on these um, archers. I love this music so much. It is awesome. Okay, strike down multiple of multiple of these um, archers. They are they are um, spit fire. The um, you, you really can have all that. I don't mean to go back in that crowd. Uh, I was gonna say you didn't have all that hard of a time, all things considered, and I go to the door and intentionally ease. Uh, 
Don't know why I'm angry. But whatever. I'm taking on these orcs. Uh, these orcs are getting the bane of my existence, I swear. They're not all that hard of enemies to deal with either. Hey, hey. I was storm pup. Ha <laughs> ha I love storm pups. I really do. We like them. That just have an explosive cloud. Is it there? Maybe like I have trap or incoming enemies. Wait, every fourth floor we have a little platforming segment. These, uh, I don't quite call them hard per se, but yeah, just a nice little frequently, I guess, action, I guess you could say. Still. That for the sun. Um, ah! I don't think it's talk, right? These. This uh, this area can be pretty tough. I'm not gonna lie. Let's do that. Burn you down. Great. The dying corpse of that one mummy got in the way. Thanks a lot. And I need a potion right away. But yeah, this is a testament to how tough this area can actually be. I don't know. I don't know if I'm just sucking really hardcore, but. Never have a smooth playthrough the first time around. Doesn't help that we have to face all these knights in the process. Please, go down. Jeez, I know you take a lot of hits, but still, jeez. Thank you. All these red knights are taken down. I, I don't know if there's um, any kind of um, metaphor used for red knights. I know there's like, I, I know that, that, ah, damn it, I can't talk. I know the um, White Knight and Black Knight thing, but what is Red, Red Knight new place for? Yeti! If it is for anything at all, I can wait to be even the Hey, this is my least favorite floor. Yeah, yeah. Yeti! The slimes here, you can potentially take a lot of damage because they keep spinning like small bits and pieces of themselves. Yeah, that is in my opinion one of the toughest floors in this entire tower. And guess what? If you're going for 100%, you have to complete this not once, but twice! Yeah! I'm most likely going to be doing this off screen, but if you complete this twice, you get a magic jam- you get a magic jam at the end of your- at the end of this, um... You're not dead yet? Okay, I hit you with, uh, my step fire. How are you not dying that? Uh, that's really gonna hurt. No oh, error. Killing out of pipe, anyway. Ah, uh, it's always good to have that around. There is the, um, flamethrower, which is the final step of the firepower. If you can get that, that tears crap up. Spit, okay. This will tear our enemies apart, spin their eyes, and make them red their pants. It is that good in the Battle Tower. Unfortunately, I couldn't get that to the lack of gems. Oh well. I should be able to salvage this somehow. I say somehow. Oh man. Oh, because you know, she has a couple, um, partners here. Yeti! Yeah. I don't know, but... You know what? Screw this. Storm pop, storm pop him. Wow! Fail! Hardcore. Fail. Let's take this guy. Let's take this one out for now. Can you onward? Uh, thankfully there's not much left of the, um, battle tower. Uh, I'm really, I'm really, really worried about this last four. Because we have like a few knights to do with. These red knights aren't all the battle things to consider, I guess. One. There you go! Let's see if I can... Wow, not, not even the storm puff hit someone with their shield up. Bend them! I mean, come on, their face is clearly exposed! And 
I used more potions than I intended. Missing every shot didn't help either. Yeah, thundercloud. Not the worst than storm cup fail. Yeti. I hit him like maybe once with the thunder puff. There you go. Jeez. Why did we fail due to time constraint? Is this going to happen? I barely have any time left to take on this boss room because we have a lot more enemies here to face off with. A bunch of slime and a bunch of... Okay. If I can actually make this, that would be a real miracle. See if we can form a miracle back. Scarecrow aren't too bad to deal with. Oh, but... Okay. Um, I don't know if it's my imagination, but I seem to take on I seem to take on a noggin when this fine. <laughs> that can't even go my way, jeez. I'll be right back. Okay, and we are back. Thankfully, I have much more time to work with this time. But I still can't guarantee I'll make it through this. Um, I'll have, I'll have my Mega Puck equipped just because I can. Because that worked out so well for me last time. And I, I should probably shift to the um, standard. Oh, that's what I need right now. Okay. That. We put this aside, thankfully. So just. Mm-hmm. Puff, fail, then you miss Klaus. Yeah! That is how you thundercloud. Yeah, that, that is how you thunderpuff. Amazing. Okay, I need a potion now. Okay, I can pretty much do this from here. Okay. Die. Die! I'm gonna get you before you're able to shoot off your arrows. Have these mummies here. Not all that bad a deal with this, but they have the fire. So. Okay. Yeah, I was that close before. I actually failed. There you go. Blue Knight taking that. One of them, at least. One of them. Yeah, they actually have a bigger blast than the Red Knights. And they have more health, but it doesn't matter. We are done. Take our magic seal and GTFO. Great boss fight. Great boss fight. Just combine a ton of enemies we've already fought before. A single room. Great boss fight. Looks like we got a winner. Let's see what you found up there. Uh, what's that? Magic squeal? 
I mean, the Emerald Baron only kept viable charges up there. This chunky chunk. Phew. That's embarrassing. Tell you what. Got other stuff up there, too. Like actual cash prizes. Some Something worth something. So come back anytime. Yeah. So come back anytime for your match. I'll set you up with some real prizes you can use. I'll try your best scores and all that. Really make it worth your while. Just so there's no hard feelings. Take this here. We got a random key that is used in a forest, cause why not? No idea what the thing's for. It's old. Looks like some something a wood sprite would use to wind their watch with or some something. Take it, it's yours. Thanks, very good, Joe. You're a lifesaver. Yes. Don't say kiss to me unless you're actually gonna give me a kiss. Otherwise, it's just words, okay? Okay. Cheers. <laughs> okay, you're doing it again. Okay, <laughs> cool. You're gonna hit that save room. First stop on your left. Uh, Barracuda Joe and well, both of you and Barracuda Joe sound. You both rock, seriously. Hey, Risky Boots! Exciting news for both you and I! You're a playable character and have Genie Hero! How's that make you feel? I had a feeling you'd show up. I'm afraid my patience for you is starting to wear thin. Why don't you hand over both magic seals now and save you and your dear uncle from any further unpleasantness? Never! Fine. We'll do this the hard way. Both beg for mercy in the end. You'll see. Um, why didn't you make... Uh, something's definitely up. Yeah, I'm saving the game here now. Yes, I'm the... Battle Tower. Also, can I end the episode now? It's like 30 minutes on my end because of shit, stuff going wrong. No, no, no. I'm not going to do that. It's a, I, so, uh, top of the, um, ow. Those guys are, which, um, those guys are purely invincible. I guess as far as I know. Even the Thunder Puff is useless, useless against those things, they're just hazards, for the most part. Right here, right here. Eh, your ear is also something we're gonna want to remember for a little bit later. Just, just something to remember. Okay. As you are indeed gonna be, um, coming back. Anyway, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go and uh, meet you in the forest. And I'm not editing this episode. Okay, the place we need to go is right in here. To get this. um... Yeah, this is where we need the forest key. It leads straight in here. To a couple of really, really long hallways with a couple of blocks in the way. Hey! I wonder what it is we're gonna be getting here. Maybe a way to deal with those cement blocks? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe you'll get a new item. Maybe you'll get a new power. Maybe a new dance. Who knows? Maybe some jam and jelly. Some ultra shrooms. I don't know. Maybe some awesome tasty super super ultra tasty snacks. I can do some of that. Maybe find a way to fry some of these crabs and turn them into dinner. Maybe some of these flying items. Yeah, that that would be way too cool. Oh, whatever. Oh, and there's. Hold on. Yeah, nothing special there besides some pottery. But... Ah. Go right, freaking crabs! Jeez. Gee, they don't even give me anything, I'm sure, and how lame. 
I go out of my I go out of my way to murder you and this time you're paying me. Yeah, that's that's fantastic. Go go away, thank you. Okay, I know this plot's not necessary, but I just wanna murder all bots! Guess where it's I need profit! Guess I agree, asshole. I know. It's kinda of the whole point. We go over here. Yep. It's a fountain. Who purchased my magic fountain? My butt senses a uh, restless energy deep inside you. Channel your passions and allow your butt to take shape. <laughs> the elephant dance is ours. Alright. This. We can turn it to our town's mascot. Ha <laughs> ha! And also, this is, uh, yes. We can transform into an elephant. Make sure in this dance pose, we can smash any of those blocks that are in array. And. Pots as well. But again, what doesn't shatter pots? I believe we had this way. Yeah, it's just. A small little to get some extra things. Which is all real and dandy. Also, as you notice with the um, open dance, if you dash forward, you can also make it across um, certain gaps. Which is actually really. is It's actually completely tight. Ah, it can be pretty useful. And you can get you certain stuff. You end up later. For now. Screw planning, I just wanna smash my way through, damn it! Alright. I'm not making too much fun of the elephant. So just leave. Hey, bring that. Where are you going? Yes, where to? Where, where are you guys? I mean, for long. Shante, right? Stick with the brain? From Skeletown? Yeah, we got a brain. Yeah, she's the one little sis is always running is running at her ma mouth about. You guys are right house brothers? Yeah, that's right. Abner Cutover, the oldest. This here's Poe. Right here, cuz we got a proposition for you. Like Like we you know your next step is the hypno baron. His oceanic fortress is impenetrable. There ain't no way you're breaking in there without our help. Okay, what do you guys want? Zabra's that bears deep into the seaside cliffs. It's all the tricks and traps. Very, very dangerous. Our offer is this. We get you in. In turn, we're gonna brew some coffee. A bee. It's serious. Yeti! You know what, while bringing zombies, strong cup of joe is the only thing that keeps and separates us from them. So do it. I'm gonna be there when Sis's eyes roll back and she goes freak show on ya. You gonna need a coffee machine? It's a fresh coffee bean. Oh, I like mine with a little rotten egg mixing. Yeah, I wonder where we can find a rotten egg. Drop it off the boathouse and we'll hook you up with a way to get you in the elaborate. Get all that? I hear, but let's see if they have to do a coffee run. You ain't gotta do it. Let's go look inside Emma Baron's digs, if you know. Eeny, we have no choice but to do it. Okay. Now, for real, I think we've done enough for this episode, so we're going to be calling this quits here. Next time on Shantae Risky's Revenge, not only will we be doing that coffee run, but we'll also be doing various different things and, well, things and stuff that we couldn't before. Now we have the elephant dance at our disposal. See you guys then.
I sound like a zombie when I did that. 